Johnny here. Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing a little haul. So as you may notice on um, my Instagram story I have posted that I had shopped at Miss A again. This time I was mostly focusing on the eyes and I did got a couple products as well. Um, so we're going to be doing that here today. I literally just received my package yesterday. As you can see I got that green box up there. Now no they do not come in boxes. However I put it in a box because as you can see I like to pile up my packages together. Anyways, so let's go ahead and show you guys what I got because I got like literally so many things for a price that you wouldn't even imagine. Okay, so let's go. So my first things I'm going to show are these party lashes in the number 34002. Excuse my nails. I know they're like pretty ugly right now. I'm working on something, so please tolerate me. So these are the party lashes number 34002. They come in two pairs, obviously. Um, I don't know the name perfect. I don't know if that's the name perfect glamour. I got two of the same ones. Um, as you can see, they're just regular lashes, but on the first ones here, they have little like bedazzled across them. They have rhinestones. I think they're really cute. I'm curious how this is gonna look. Also, I did get this professional press powder blush. It kind of reminds me of the Milani blush. It has a little rose print right there, as you can see. And here's my Milani blush, the rose. No lie, with this black casing, it could be part of the Rebel Rose collection. Two palettes from Amuse Cosmetics. This is the purple palette. And this is the navy palette. I didn't open anything yesterday. The only things I opened were these palettes because I was doing a swatch test. I'll go ahead and put a picture right here. This is the swatch of the purple palette. As you can see, like it, it's buildable. Like the purples, they do look patchy. However, it is buildable. And here's the swatches of the navy palette. It's the navy palette, but I only see like three out of the twelve colors the blue undertone or that is blue so I mean I guess I'm not complaining so you know this was way pigmented this was like way more pigmented than this was this the purple was a little patchy but I don't blame him because patchy um mattes are usually more difficult to work with than shimmer shades so we're gonna see if I can make it work because I mean I don't blame it with the patchiness because like I said purple is hard to work with but also it is a dollar makeup so I mean you know, we'll see how that is. I also got this AOA Studio Buildable Set and Foundation. And it has that little A plus symbol right there, guys. You can see. That usually means um a portion um uh, a portion goes towards the kids' education. So that's a like that's a bonus, you know. All about the kids guys. All about the kids. Um yeah. So I'm curious how that is. It kind of reminds me of those little dewdropper foundations that came from, what was it, Too Faced? I also got the AOA Studio, once again, A Plus Edition, Wonder Blender. So it's latex free and high definition sponge. So yeah. Everything's still in these packages. Nothing was opened except of the two eyeshadow palettes. So. I also got the Brow Pomade AOA Studios in the color medium brown number 3024. It's really, really small compared to like any brow pomade that I have. Like, look how big this is. And then this one as well. Yeah, like this is like really small. It's cute. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cute. But once again, can't blame it for it being a dollar, so I mean. It's cute though. I'm not gonna lie. It's like transportable, but you can lose it on a purse. So be careful, ladies. I also got this Amuse Cosmetic Voluminous Mascara. I think it's like super pretty how ombre it is. It goes from like a black to a pink. Let's see how the wand is. So it's just like a regular thick wand. Doesn't have a smell. Wait.
It actually smells like pineapple. It smells like pina colada there. If you like pina coladas, get caught in the rain. There you go. So yeah, we might as well just take the sticker off. It's open. Okay. So there's that. I'm I'm really can't wait to try this one out. I'm it's really pretty. So the packaging, amazing. I also got the new pop fruity flavored gloss, watermelon and apple. I cannot wait to try these out. There's no color. No, I'm not a fan of color lip glosses, so I'm all about the clear lip gloss. So I'm really curious about these. I also got y'all gonna be so impressed with me i got the aoa studio go brow gel i know i know like i never really wear brow gel but um i just had to try this out it's in the color dark brown in number 3004 it comes in this small little packaging it's really cute i'm not gonna lie once again excuse my nails i know they're like uh. but yeah i think it's really cute i'm really curious on how this is gonna you know go so we'll see also like i was running out of eyeliner like eyeliner pencil and liquid liner i mean i have a couple yeah so i have a couple but i was running out so when i went online i found by amuse cosmetics they have a two-in-one pencil liquid eyeliner now i am really curious to see how this works i know obviously there's not gonna be much pencil um because it's like this much and like this bottom half is the eyeliner but it looks super cool for the fact it's two in one like you know it's pretty crafty as if you could ask if you ask me i also now i was curious about this one like Y'all saw the lip colors I wear. I'm I wear pretty gun like grungy colors, you know. Like I like to wear dark lipsticks every once in a while. Now this one got me curious. I got the AOA Studio Wonder Metal Liquid Lipstick in the color Rogue and the number two 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 four. So it's a a black metallic lipstick. We're gonna go ahead and swatch it actually. Let me open it up. wasn't open now it is so we're gonna go ahead and swatch that right here for you guys because i'm curious i'm i plan on doing a makeup look Ooh, <gasps> that smells super pretty like kylie jenner who that smells super pretty guys okay so here's that wand applicator like obviously a simple lipstick tube a liquid lipstick tube um it smells great guys now we're gonna go ahead and swatch it <gasps> no way can you guys see? obviously you guys can see that <gasps> that is so pretty you guys can see that right look at that I am impressed blown away I'm blown away that's what I am Okay, and for the last thing of my haul, I also got these AOA Studio Makeup Removers. Oh, wait, no, it's not the last thing. I almost forgot. You were hiding. Okay, so I got these AOA Studio Makeup Remover Cleansing Wipes. I got it in cucumber and rose water. So I did get, like, good scents for the skin tone. They also have one that's non-scented. However, like, I want things scented because usually when I use the non-scented ones, like, I feel like it smells funny naturally i guess it's because of cleaning soaps or whatever no i yeah i usually use neutrogena and i just personally don't like the smell of it but these i'm curious so yeah this is the aoa one two three cucumber and this is aoa one two three rose water and last but not least i also got the aoa studio glow baby illuminating drops in the number zero seven five in the color holograph did I say holograph L88? Yeah. So it's this really, really tiny, tiny drop. And as you can see on the camera, 
it has a blue undertone to it like those blue iridescence so that's like i didn't know there was going to be like a blue iridescent to it in the picture it didn't show that like i'm not mad at it these don't even look like drops to be honest okay so right off the bat i opened it up and it looks super creamy it doesn't even look like drops and i'm pressing down it looks like super, it looks mostly, mostly creamy so maybe we should shake it first let's try shaking it guys because it's supposed to be drops those don't look like drops first because they don't look like drops no i guess it's like naturally creamy like i'm not mad once again because it is a dollar but i mean they're drops are supposed to be drops so i'm gonna go ahead and place it down <gasps> that's so pretty hold on guys hold on oh you see that that is uh, anastasia beverly who who that is so pretty so this is oh. now i'm all for like color highlighter i like to wear blue highlighter purple highlighter green highlighter especially when the month of october comes because i mean that's all about makeup playtime I waited for some time for the liquid lipstick to cool down, so let's see if it dries. Look at this, guys. It's not transfer. It's not smearing. It dried down. I am impressed once again, AOA makeup. And this highlighter, once again, not smearing either. I don't know if y'all can see that. No, you can't. It's not smearing. It's staying in place. I am really impressed. Like I said, it's it remind it gives me those iridescent alien vibes. I guess you can say. And I'm I'm living for it. Oh, October is coming up, and like I I think I mentioned it before in my previous videos. In the month of October, I do plan on doing a Halloween last minute makeup session where. I will be collecting ideas from you guys, any suggestions on what you want to be, and I would try to recreate those looks doing makeup. So, that, this highlighter, where is it? This highlighter, I am super curious on how it's going to apply to the face, like as of the eyeshadows, because you know what they say, swatches aren't always the best. But it's better to see how it applies to the face. So yeah, I'm really curious on how that's going to turn out. Alright guys, well, that's it for now. Now, stay tuned for my upcoming video where I'm wearing nothing but AOA makeup. Nothing but AOA. Nothing but a dollar makeup on my face, so stay tuned for that. Also, you should be staying tuned for... Um, <sighs> Sorry, I'm like out there. Um, you should also be staying tuned for a back to school shopping kindergarten style where I'll be showing the applies of a kindergartner and also I noticed that you guys really enjoyed the husband does my makeup challenge I for one thought it was hilarious like I did not expect the response from my husband like oh I know you have no makeup experience at all so you think you've never done makeup before so you think you've done makeup before uh, no, but I. Okay, so, so but I got paint skills. Well, I, yeah, you have paint skills. I know you're good with blending and colors. Okay. Um. In a way, I kind of did, but at the same time, I didn't. So yeah. Um. So, also, I want to thank you guys for reaching 200 subscribers. I am around two, seven. I'm. I think I'm at 220, 218. I don't know what numbers I'm at right now, but I'm close to 220 subscribers. I want to thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. I have reached 200 subscribers as of yesterday morning, and I'm still rising as of right now. Thank you guys so much for that. Um, I do have a lot of video ideas coming up soon. I, When I reach a certain number of subscribers, I do plan on doing a little small giveaway as well, so stay tuned for that. Um, also, I want to say that like, I'm just really impressed about these makeups and the items I have received in the package yesterday so I'm really curious on how that turns out I will do everything on camera for the first time for you guys literally right after this video but I'm gonna post it up a different day 
so give you guys time to you know okay so yeah um i guess i'll see you guys next time bye hotties